Welcome to What's New at AWS. Recently, Amazon CloudFront has announced availability of Embedded Point of Presence or POP. It is a new type of CloudFront infrastructure. It is purpose-built for byte-heavy casual workloads such as live stream video, video on demand, game or software downloads. Let's deep dive to understand what benefit we can get from this component. Assume a scenario where you have launched a very popular game or software update and as soon as it is released, people across the globe will start downloading it. User 0 will connect with local internet service provider or mobile network operator for internet. Now ISP will exchange internet traffic with CloudFront CDN through local internet exchange point. It will be routed to CloudFront Edge, then mid-tier cache, regional cache, which will finally pull the content from origin, S3 bucket in this case. And the content will be cached at regional cache and edge pop. Now for different set of users using same ISP, content will be retrieved from CloudFront edge cache through internet exchange. And flow will be same for the users using different ISP or mobile network operators. So internet exchange is the common local place where different ISP, MN or CDN exchange their internet traffic. And this may potentially cause congestion. Embedded POF here tries to address this issue by deploying hardware server appliance within ISP infrastructure. So now users don't have to go all the way to the CloudFront Edge POP through Internet Exchange. Content is available in much closer embedded POP at your ISP location. Also, ISP does not have to go beyond its own network infrastructure for this type of cacheable content. Using embedded POP, we can achieve low network latency, high throughput, traffic uploading from origin, and improvement in fast byte latency. Currently, CloudFront has 13 regional edge cache, 600 plus POP in 100 plus cities, and 600 plus embedded POP across 200 plus cities. Assume there is no embedded POP here, so users from this area get cacheable content from nearest edge location Vancouver, which is geographically far away. But with embedded POP, Byte heavy cacheable content are now much closer to the end user. As an application owner, contact AWS sales representative to evaluate if your AWS workload is suitable for embedded POPs or not. If suitable, you can opt in for this capability and there is no additional charge for using it. Once enabled, both CloudFront props and embedded POPs will work hand in hand to provide the best possible performance to your end users. One important note, CloudFront is PCI, HIPAA, and SOC compliant, but that excludes content served through embedded POP, possibly because this is physically part of third-party network infrastructure. If you are ISP owner, connect with AWS, they will provide you the hardware appliance, but you will manage everything using the embedded portal. And there is no additional cost for this. You can request new appliance, monitor, or get support using this self serve web portal. So log into this portal using peering DB accounts and make your customers happy. If you got value out of this video, please give it a thumbs up and subscribe to this channel. Thanks for watching.